reheat some leftovers for lunch like I'm Emily Mikado. And that's the cat from Suits, isn't it? What is it? Like I'm Emily Mariko. <laughs> this is the stuff from the crock pot last Friday when I was doing the hand waxing video where I had to then heat the wax up in the microwave. So inconsiderate of my wife. Does she, she not know? Oh, there she is, she's coming. Did I show you the parchment paper trick? Get ready to have your mind blown. Do you mind tearing me off a bit, please? Like the size for the air fry? Thank you very much. Oh, I'm oh, sorry, baby. Kofi. Good riddance. This is obviously something I saw on TikTok. Parchment paper, horrible to move anywhere. Parched. Um, unparched. Look at that. You need to act at least like impressed by me Whoa, for some, thank, oh my gosh. thank you, isn't it amazing? Well, that's not the first time I've left her dissatisfied. If you're from Kansas City, you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. Joe's barbecue sauce, best barbecue in, I haven't really tried much outside of Kansas City. So in Kansas City, it's actually kind of funny because when my dad and I first came over here to look at a college, we flew into Wichita, Kansas. And a, like, as we were taking a shuttle to find our hire car, this guy was, we were just talking and he said, you have to try some barbecue here. I'm like, okay, where do we try? And he said, Oklahoma Joe's, which is now Joe's of Kansas City. And I think until my final year in college, so almost four years later, that's when I first tried it for the first time and then I made the connection. And now it's our favorite place to get barbecue from. And if you want to try it, I think they actually ship it online. I know that sounds weird, but like they ship the whole sandwich. Get yourself a original Z-Man, Z-Man, Z-Man. Oh, dude, the fries are amazing too, but if you're shipping it, don't bother with those. We normally eat all of our meals together, but I went to the gym while they ate lunch, so I'm on my Todd. Oh, Jimkin, it's a big piece. Don't choke, dude. Something I really appreciate that we did as a family growing up was always ate at least dinner together every night. Unless like my sister and I had sports, which was most nights of the week. And we'd, <laughs> my mum would make food and we'd eat on the car, in the car on the way to practice or training, whatever it was. Looks like I overcooked it slightly. <laughs> Oh, what the hell? I'm pretty sure earlier I said this was chicken. This is not chicken, this is pork. Someone's gonna cancel me for lying to you. I have my thought on the whole cancel culture thing, right? People can try to cancel you, but you are in power of getting canceled. Like, let's say you do something wrong and then you realize that it actually was a mistake. And you just apologize for it. You're all like, we're all just learning. We're all learning how to do the right thing. And so if it's a genuine mistake, Dudo, you want some more chicken? I bet you do, you little fatty. I'd say this is a perfect indication of how I live my life. It doesn't need to be perfect as long as it serves the purpose. Now, eating like a TikToker who just made a meal that he wants to go viral on TikTok. <clears throat> I hate it. Not the sandwich. I love the sandwich.